Another controversial beachfront development. Anybody home? Zulu don't surf. Lovely. So, the quarantine corridor to the lifeguard tower. Locked down. What would Captain Ellie Vixen do? Command override. Here we go. Stay frosty, Jay. Of course I'll need the fucking code. Reception was a bloodbath. Two stars. Duty roster. Hold on. I need to know when. Wednesday. That's the last day. Fella on duty was Hicks. So, corpse or zombie? Corpse or zombie? Not a sausage. Nope. Jacob Nilpoin. Not a sausage. Lovely. More of the code. Still got to find Hicks, or at least his tags. And he had a bad tum. Potty time. Lovely. One master code. Set phases to exfoliate. I'm Jacob. This is Warrant Officer Rodriguez. You should turn around, dumbass. That corridor is not secure. But it's your funeral. Out. Funeral, schmuneral. Once more unto the breach. <laughs>
gate to your right. It's wall to wall puppets, so last chance to turn back. Do not attempt to enter the tower or I'll send a squad to toss your ass out. My ass is mine, and mine to toss alone. So, Rodriguez, what you hiding? Still nothing. Rodriguez, dost thou attempt to deceive? <laughs> so, loads of traps, but no squad of grunts. Mine. All mine. trying to get killed on occasion but not today get over here and explain yourself i am not playing you always do the opposite of what you're told i wanted to come up and see the whole gang stupid well lesson learned the whole anti-social misanthrope routine is because just shut up okay Right now, you are sand in my grease. There's two ways this goes. You make yourself useful, or my boot propels your ass back where it came from. Quid pro quo, Rodriguez. Quid pro quo. Ugh, right. How about some genuine U.S. Army gear? Finest in the world. Or so they tell us. Then consider me quoed. We've got a deal. Then listen up. I got a hole in my defenses. Fuppets keep coming from the pits out back, and contrary to rumor, I'm particular about exposing my rear. Pit? Death pits? How do we deal with that? Fire. Burn them all.
first floor. Back entrance. Soon. I'll be locking the door behind you. Comic books like to say. Chubby trouble. Rise into heaven, wings of black smoke. Quite the fire starter, aren't ya? Not really. I prefer gin and tonic beside the pool. That acid gunk was a waste of time. Should have burnt them from the get-go. Must be hard seeing your comrades burn. No, they were enemy combatants. And that's why you can't fight a conventional war. Yeah, perhaps we should follow the signs. 
I already got science on my team. And you should leave before you change sides. No way you're not infected. Paradigm shift. I'm immune. Immune? I heard they were looking. You might be more useful than I thought. And you? I'm headed to the Surling. Could use some cover in fire. This horde has to stay contained. I won't be leaving. But here's your paycheck. Hey, you're not serious about going to Ocean Avenue, right? It's suicide to even try. Suicide is for the sane. Derangement is my special weapon. I'm not gonna lie. It's tough beyond this gate. Any, any more detail? Numbers? Sizes? I mean, I can wing it, but... Well, if anyone can, you can. Rabbit soup coming up.
Oh, man. I've raised my shin. Oh. Sterling Hotel, Dr. Reed, and the CDC. Ocean Avenue, the Sterling Hotel must be close. This green zone is looking nice and quiet. The Serling Hotel. At last. Signs of survivors. Awesome.
I can almost smell that crisp laundry. And enchanting company. Oh, you are, huh? You're not here to eat us, then. There isn't enough ketchup in the world. <laughs> Comedian, huh? They look human to you. Hmm. So-so. Hmm. Well, okay, then. Humans can be redeemed. Don't need to waste a bullet on this one. Hey, keep up the good work, Denise. Hey, I'm Dr. Reed, but you can call me Reuben. Let's talk in my office. We spoke on the radio about the vaccine. Hey, shh, shh. Walk with me. I'm glad you made it. Really glad, but we gotta keep your specialness on it down low. If you really are what we've been looking for, then CDC is gonna want to talk to you. So Doctor, he doesn't want to take his shot. Ah, uh, hey, Luther. Hey, don't worry. It's just gonna pinch a bit. Let's keep walking. Where was I, um... CDC's going to... CDC, right, right, right. The CDC's gonna... Hey, 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 I, to I told you to stay off that foot. You want me to cut it off? <laughs> come on. Hey, come this way, huh? Now. <clears throat> so glad you're here. Now, they're gonna send a chapter to pick you up and take you to Colorado. Just you. So, I don't want my people here getting hope when they... when they got none. You understand? None? I wasn't expecting that. Oh, we'll be okay. <laughs> Fall over nine times and you, you get up ten. That's what I always say. But you, you got a miracle in your blood. If we can get you to Colorado, oh, humanity has a chance. Okay. So, you call a chopper, or...? Well, I need to let them know you're here yeah. first, and then I... Yeah. We're out of food! We need to sweep those apartments before someone else cleans no, them no, out. No, no, we gotta put that on hold. This person here is our new priority. Hey, Jacob. They're more important than people starving? Yeah. I mean, no, I mean, look, kind of. I can't really talk about it right now, but... That's wait. fine. Look, you stay here. I'm gonna go with these guys. Hey, we'll hey, be hey. back soon. Hey, you do not go outside without me. They can handle it. Hey, Doc, you know we ran out of food. <sighs> What's the plan? Hey, uh, Dad! I am not a little girl anymore. I have to do my share. Yeah. Obviously, you've lost your mind. There are terrorists oh, out just there. Just let her go, you... Doc. She wants to be Jimmy, part of the team. Jimmy, I am talking to my daughter. I'm okay? sick of talking. Jimmy's right. I need to do something. After all that's happened, you think I'm going to let you out of my sight? Oh, I'm going to let you turn into one of them like your mother? Oh, no. <sighs> Tisha, I'm sorry, but I. I can't lose you two. You're right, Dad. I shouldn't put this on you, it's not fair. Well, okay then. Come on. See you later? Yeah. Yeah, this is no place for human beings. Hey, Doc, a word of advice. You want to stay top dog? You let your daughter take her chances just like everyone else. Jimmy, I have got enough things to be focusing on without your bullshit. Sure. Yeah. I'm gonna go for a smoke. Yeah, you do that. The fuck you looking at? <laughs> Don't make me say it, chum. I need to radio CDC, but I don't want to draw too much attention to you, so... Look, you make yourself at home, and I should have some good news soon. Okay? I'm knackered. I could sleep for a week. English.
He's not there. Someone got sick. I need what? He's coming back, right? Fucking better be. Bob's taking way too long. Damn it. Okay, I'll bite. Who's Bob? Janitor for this place. If you tried taking a shower, you'd know the water's out. Bob went to get it back on. I do need the bath. Hot. With bubbles. I'll go see if he needs help. Are my ears working? Did someone just offer to help out? That would be great. We won't last long without fresh water. Bob was headed for the janitor's office. Downstairs, behind the stores. Right, so. Told Reuben I'll be right back, okay? Some of us might die of thirst. The rest. On with the deer stalker. <laughs> Boom, safe code. Main valve, boiler room, basement car park. With any luck, Bob's still there.
Right, you lot. You're not welcome. Okay, Bob, main water valve there. And back to safety. Bloody hell! <laughs> Bob died on the job. Poor Bob. Hot bath, bubbles, wind up duck, bottle of single malt. Bob had an accident. I figured. 
but he did fix the water before he got irreversibly dismembered. Oh yeah? That helps. A lot. You know, there's plenty of other folks missing. A whole bunch of them on the notice board over there. I doubt I'll have time. Ruben's back in his office. You wanted him, right? Lovely. Thanks, Denise. Don't let Jimmy get to you. It's like that with him. So, a refreshing stroll to the Halperin Hotel. Hey, Rubes. Hey. There you go. I keep the eyes shut. Twelve hours. No light, okay? Good news, I hope. Uh, not really. The CDC isn't calling the shots anymore. The military have taken command, and they won't extract you until they have proof of your immunity. Control freaks. They're just so paranoid about the virus escaping from L.A. They know they can't contain it if it gets out. So you kill me, and if I stay dead, we're golden? Nothing quite so crude as that. But we have to test you. But my equipment is at the CDC HQ by Santa Monica Beer. Sound trumpets and let our bloody colors wave. Right, oh. Oh, oh, oh I, I don't know. I don't think you should go alone. Hey, I thought that we were like cat ghosts. Fall down nine times? Get up ten? Right? Right. Well, this cat will be right back. There's loads of chalky bars out there, all over the place. Kind of sinister. I know. I know. I know what you are. I know what you are! That makes one of us. Name's Jacob. Heard you need some help. Help? That's what she... You're here to steal just like her. Huh! Next thing you'll say is that I can trust you, too. Trust no one. Who stole from you? Denise! She came in when I wasn't here. Without my permission. And she stole the bag that was right underneath my bed, and, and she can't do that. That's wrong. Hey, calm your wobble. I'll help. What's your name? Luther. Cool name. Look, I'll have a chat with Denise. Sort this out, yeah? No, she wants that. She wants you to talk. Then she'll steal your teeth. And you won't even get a nickel. I'm not like her. My buddy Byron, he'll see you right. Jolly good. You stay put. No, 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 I didn't. I, I didn't lose him. Yeah, what? I just ran into a lovely local resident called Luther. Ugh, no, you ran into a mess called Luther. That boy's on random shuffle. He said you took his bag. He's inconsolable. That bag was stinking. Ava and Ken were bitching so bad I threw it out. Hmm, stinky bag. What was making the stink? I do not want to know. Couldn't get near it without gagging. I just tossed it down the trash chute. Look, the boy's freaking people out. I'm gonna track this bag down, see what we can do. Whatever, go knock yourself out. But if he doesn't calm down, he's going down the chute too. If you're out, please respond. This is Hannah at the Venice Canal. You leaving again? Hello? It's cool, I get it. The zombies are better company than us.
Week's worth of trash. Searching for the right stink amidst a sea of stink. If you're watching now, Mum, this is a temporary career diversion. Nothing but rubbish. Nothing here either. <laughs> Hell, I'm practically carrying a big bag of meat, mate. Hey, wait a minute. Denise is not going to be happy. Jeez. Yes, yes! 
one stinky bag. You actually... you did it? <sighs> Thank you. <sighs> this is... this is Byron. You guys met? Not face I, to face, no. Byron's a hell of a guy, hey? You know, he's... he's always got your back. You could take on anything, you know? <laughs> Best goddamn friend I ever had. Thanks for bringing him back. It's gonna be okay now. Yeah. All right, man. <laughs> oh, I'll give you some privacy. Cool. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hold on. Your reward. Delightful. As promised. With our heartfelt thanks. Yeah, bring it in, man. <laughs>